I might have missed two cheers while I was trying to get everything set up. Sorry about that. Let's go with the same style we always do. We should go all out and make his hair, uh, hair white. So he can look like Moses. There we go. We'll go with Moses. Hello, Kitty. She's back in the lap again. Can we get into the game? Yes! It must be a problem with those streamer servers. I'm gonna have to hit them up. Um, let's go with that middle area. We haven't actually tried that one yet. Oh, I missed Peyton following. Damn it, I thought he fixed that. Did it not make a noise when you followed? But uh, anyway, thanks for following, Peyton. Peyton. The notification did stay up longer. Good. Did it make a noise? I'll choose a different weapon this time. I really like the axe, but I'll, I'll probably try the wand. All right. So this is a new area. I haven't been to this one before. You know, since we were forged with fire, I think we should be immune to fire. Like any kind of lava, any of that junk, we should be completely immune to. All right, first things first. I want to I wanna build on the ocean again. Let's pick up some uh, wood and stuff on the way. But I want to build either on the river or I want to build on the water again. I think that's south. We'll take a look at the map once we get out of here. And it's a little dark because, well, it's dark. Well, I figured I, I figured the, the staff is going to be very common, so I want to pick the wand to just do something different. That maybe a lot of folks don't pick. I try to be different because I'm different, man. Whoa, hey, easy on the zoom. Uh, there is a lake north of us. But I think there's an actual ocean south, if I recall correctly. So we'll probably head out and go south. Yeah, let's go this way. I'm different, man. I'm different than everybody else. Nobody understands me. Uh, yeah, I think we have to go out this way. There might be another door out there, but I think this is a safe bet. Because I'd be pissed if I walk all the way around. And then turns out I can't get out there. Is this the game with no falling damage? What other game did I play? That nope, wait, this game. My okay, we're actually inside, so we're safe from falling damage. I think. Let's find out. Oh god. Nice. And the thing is, we fell outside the barrier when we did that, so we actually got really lucky. All right. Gonna pick up as much stuff as we can on the way. Yeah, as I was falling, I was like, "Wait a minute, I'm pretty sure this has falling damage." Uh oh. Being attacked by something. Better not be. Oh, there's a person. Squeaky Duck. Hello, Squeaky Duck. This is interesting. Oh! Monolith of Rage. Grant you 15 damage and 80 health for 60 minutes. Sweet. Can I, uh... Punching it doesn't work. That's just no, uh, E. Hmm. Alright. I don't know how to use it. I need to set up push to talk, too, so I can actually talk to people that run by. In case I want to say hello. Oh, so thank you, Tally, for the five bit cheer. Again, I know I'm late. I'm not hearing any noises, I don't think. Yeah, the interact, interact button wasn't working. Interact is E, right? I might come back for it if I figure out I did it. But no, I was... Because, yeah, I picked stuff up with E, right? Yeah. I was pressing E. I was pressing buttons. I'm pressing buttons, and it didn't work. All right, well, anyway, we're just going to pick up everything we can along the way. I realize we got a level. Hmm, I wonder if the stream thing of a bobber is having problems, or did it? It was just way late, okay. I'm not hearing it. I don't know what my issue is. If it continues to be a problem, I'll hop onto the test site thing and give her a whirl. Let's sprint. Because it's going to take us forever to get there. We have infinite sprint. Because this is not a survival game. That's the other element that's missing from a survival game. Is the no stamina. But that's fine. Because this is not a stamp. This is not a, uh, not a survival little game. It's a wolf. <laughs> also, there's a lack of attack sounds. I don't really think that's necessarily a survival game thing, though. 
I'm gonna juke this dog. Oh shit. Juking is not working. Piss off, dog. There we go. Oh, come on. He got through there? What? How is he getting through? Eh, we're gonna die here. <laughs> wow, he really followed really far. Holy shit. Yeah, it didn't have any kind of interaction on it at all. Wait, was there? He must be further from the ocean than I thought. Let's head over here to the west. Let's go to that lake. It's going to take us forever to get to the ocean. We might go down there later. Whoa. Let's go to the lake. The lake was... Damn it, cat. Let's go north. We'll go to the northern lake. That one looks bigger. I don't know, like, I feel like one of the good things about survival games, like, I feel like that is kind of missing in this game, is the need for food and water and all that. Like, I feel like that, especially the need to hide from, like, elemental uh, effects, I feel like that's a big reason to build a house, right? Like, having a house, having to have shelter, or to build additional houses, right? Like, in Ark, how we would have all those, oh, this is a nice view, by the way. Like, those background texts, like, that is mush. But hopefully they fix that. Make that look a little better. Because right now it looks like poo-poo. Uh, let's try this. Uh, let's try to fall on this side. There. I think... Oh, okay. It looks like you're invulnerable for a few seconds after you leave that shielding. So you're safe. Yeah, this lake looks nice and scenic. A fantastic place to remove all the trees from and build our future house and castle. Oh, yeah, that is that is a picture of Kitty. Oh, damn it. <laughs> She's not getting in her bed now. She's getting in the box. I'll either have to move. Oh, wow. Looks like somebody's smart ass is already building out here. Who's a uh, pig pen? Damn, somebody's went ballistic. Holy shit. That's fine. Oh, wow. That did you take. Well, maybe not a ton of wood. Took a pretty good bit of wood, though. All right. How about another house out here? Yeah, try uh, <laughs> try moving the box where the bed is. Because I can't stretch the camera anymore. I don't know why I'm able to stretch it now. She's going to be like, what are you doing? Stop moving my stuff. I'll turn the kitty cam on in a minute because I know what you people are here for. I need to start really... Okay. I need to really start... Uh, Twitch cam whoring it up and going, I'll turn the kitty cam on if I can get 200,000 bits. 200,000 bits and I'll let you guys see my cat for five seconds. No, I'll turn it on in just a second. Uh, yes, Peyton. You mean, uh, Peyton, you mean upload a video of this? Yes, I will be doing that. I'll be uploading this probably starting tomorrow. Because I can, after I finish the stream, I can just export. All right, hold on. Let me turn on. I know that's why you guys are really here. Hello, kitty. Hold on. You want to be famous? She's like, I'm already famous, bitch. I don't know. Also, you shouldn't say, oh, now nah, she's getting out of her bed. That's fine. She'll get back in it. There she goes. She was out of it for like two seconds. Then she's like, wait a minute. I don't want to leave my bed. Alright, hold on. It's actually harder to get it out of the box. Which seems a little weird to me. Well, of course she's got out of it, but she'll get back in in a minute. I'll turn it on then. At least the camera's set up now. To catch her. Yeah, we gave her like that. It's like a gift box. I'm going to build kind of close to this guy. I want to weird him out. Oh, there's somebody else over there too. There's another house. I don't think how far down do I want to go. I mean, I don't want to be all up in his, his shiznaws or anything. We could be neighbors. There's, this is lake is big enough for the both of us. Oh, shit. That's a camp. That's an enemy camp. So maybe not put our house right here. Damn, somebody... Okay, that's where they're at. They're at the island. It's a nice spot. I 
There's a lot of rocks over here. A lot of trees. Seems like a fairly good place to go. You need all the sticks. Yeah, have fun reinstalling Elder Scrolls while also streaming. That'll be fun. The computer will love that. Well, it's a PvE server, so they're not necessarily the enemy. But they probably are. Alright. This looks like a good place as any. To at least make a starter house. So, we gotta level up. So first things first, we gotta get structures. Gotta get walls. Uh, we can wait on the door. Because we want a weapon, of course. And we'll go with a wand. What was, what was the spell we get with a wand? Arcane, oh, arcane missile, magic missile. I fire it into the darkness. Does anybody even know that meme anymore? Come on. Hello? Oh, wait, do we start with these? No, oh, it's unlock cost two. Well, hell then. Let's build some stuff because that is a good way to get, uh, get points quickly. There we go. I'm like, why is it not letting me build? I kind of want to build out this way so we can start building towards that island if we decide to do so. We want this lower to save on wood. There we go. All right. Back to harvesting. So it could be a little slow to start with. Got to harvest. I put on my robe and wizard hat. That was different, but still good. Still a good uh, old meme. Before memes even were called memes. The pre-meme years. I guess I should go ahead. Well, I don't want to put a throne on until I've got the layout. I think I'll do 5x5 five five again. That worked pretty well. Like, I already felt like by the time I finished last time, that it was getting a little bit crowded. Like, not bad, but a little bit. We need to increase our carry capacity, too. That, I remember being very glad that I went that route. The Warcraft quest? No. Like, um, the... the Oh, thanks, Kitty. I wanted to jump. Thank you for jumping on the uh, space bar there. Uh, oh, thank you, Kitty. That was a good plan. I wouldn't have thought to jump there. Thank you for that. Do you have any more uh, high-level pro tips for me there, Kitty? I wouldn't have found these pieces of sticks if you wouldn't have jumped, if you'd stood on the space bar. Oh, thanks. I wish I could get to your level of game mastery, Kitty, but I am but a simple human. I will never understand the complexities that you easily uh, figure out. we really got to get five so we can get the spell so that we can actually cut trees down. Like, that's the big hurdle to start with. Like, having to just run around and pick up sticks, one, two, pick up sticks, is a little rough. Yeah, I know. Now she's like, hey, I got an emote. I own this stream now. I own your ass, fat boy. But yeah, I definitely will be uploading these. Alright, so that's where we wanted to go. Oh, but now she's licking my hand. She's like, eh, it's all right now, right? I'm like, okay, we're good. Okay, good. We want to... Try to find the K key. All right, move your ass, cat. Thank you. She's like, I'm a, I'm a cover of the, the uh, keyboard. They definitely should give you more knowledge points, I think, per level. I feel like they're barely giving you enough to do anything with. Uh, we'll also, we'll grab the arcane missile. Because we're going to have to defend ourselves. Uh, the potions we're definitely going to want to. But we don't really need them yet. Actually, health potion would be a good idea. So. Let's craft ourselves a wand. If we have the wood for it, we do. Very simple to make. Uh, we'll go ahead and up our carry capacity. This. Uh, 
Uh, actually, that's one thing I actually forgot about that I meant to, I was going to ask about. So, let me know if there's any judderiness. I actually increased the, uh, uh I randomly, or I just increased the, the, uh, bit rate of the stream to like, I actually doubled it to the max. Hey, hey, bad beauty. Hey, what's up? This is the first stream you've been to, I think. I just, like, I thought you disappeared. I saw you commented on a recent video. I haven't got a chance to respond to it yet. But uh, thanks for the bits. Hello. I'm still not hearing noises for bits. I think they're maybe having some issues, that server. Uh, anyway, let me sign spells. So now, hopefully, theoretically, you won't get owned by a single damn wolf. Oh, the level up. I've actually kind of gotten used to the level up now. It's not as bad, but the very first time I leveled, I was like, oh, God, like somebody's casting fireballs at me or some shit. It's like, oh, no, it's just the game making a big fanfare about leveling up. Oh, grab that. We definitely need all the wood we can. Because this is this one thing I don't like about these early levels is since you can't harvest, like one of the biggest ways you get experience is by building. And you can't really build a lot because you don't have much wood. So you have to run around like picking up sticks just to build. So until uh, you get that harvesting spell, it's rough times. It's like caveman days, like a survival game. So I'm curious, Tally, like where did you read about uh, some survival games getting ditching the, the survival aspects? I find that the interesting way to approach that problem. Though, funny enough, I actually did mention in a forum, like, in, for some reason, in the MMO forum, they were talking about this game. And somebody was like, it's not an MMO, which, of course, I upvoted because it's not a damn MMO, for sure. And I also, and somebody else specifically said, oh, it's a survival game. And I was like, well, actually, because now I'm the superior person because I've got the knowledge and experience that it's not a survival game. But I pointed out that it's actually not a survival game, as like, but it's kind of like a survival game with all these survival elements. And somebody else mentioned, oh, in that case, I'm kind of interested in it. So I guess there is people out there who like the building aspects and the skill trees and all that, but they don't like the like having to eat food and hide from the wa you know, uh, the cold and all that. But those are like some of my favorite parts. The building is my favorite part. But then again, I could get that from, like, Minecraft, right? Ah, damn it. Oh, actually, you know what? We probably could build further out. Yeah, here we go. Because the way the support system thing works. I think that's a good way of doing it, though. Uh, the way they do the, like, having it cost more every few layers because you have to have supports... I think that's a fair system. I think that's a very fair system so far. Only 58% in the level. Ugh. Oh, yeah. I know. I, I already had at least one person who's like, it's not a survival game. But then, like, which is fine. Like, I'm going to still make fun of you for correcting me just because I think it's funny. But you're right. Like it's It wasn't fair to go, it's missing some important survival elements when it's specifically not marketed as a survival game. Fair enough. But like he made the same comment in another video. I'm like, okay, did you not figure out that I, like, I recorded this all in the same day? Like, was it not obvious? Like, I wasn't going to go back in time and correct myself. Which, he might have been complaining more about the title. Because I only fixed the title in one of the videos. Because I had already, like, queued them up and everything. So, maybe that was why he did it. He just saw the title on another video and said it, like, again. Yeah, I'm bad at paying attention to chat. It doesn't help that... Okay, we have two people with the same text, but that's fine. Yeah, chat's... It's hard for me to pay attention to chat. Which, this part you'd think it'd be easy. Because I'm basically just looking around at the ground.
yeah, so yeah, definitely welcome, Bad Beauty. I am going to start streaming more. I'm going to mention that in the monthly update. But I'm shooting for, like, to start with, like, twice a week. I'm going to plan on streaming either Saturday or Sunday. I'm not quite sure yet which I'm going to, like, uh, what day and what game. Probably, I'm, well, I'm not going to say probably won't be this, because I don't really know. But I have a few games in my in my head that I might want to do. It just depends. It just depends. I set up on my screen in a different order. Wow, maybe streams. Maybe the Twitch servers are having some some issues today. Because yeah, the issue with like the the sounds for subscriptions and bits and stuff not going out. That could either be a problem with uh, Stream Pro, I think that's what I use. Uh, no, Stream Labs, that's what I use. Uh, or it could be Twitch, because if Twitch is not properly sending out all that data to them, obviously they can't respond to it properly. And with it being a Friday night, they're probably pretty busy. So, in other words, we need to go give Travis a really hard time, because this is obviously his fault. Because he works there, so therefore every single problem the Twitch has, it's his fault. Oh, okay. don't want to get too close to that camp. What level are these guys, by the way? I'm just curious. Yeah, that bug is still there. Level six, that's not too bad. I bet it, like, depending on how strong that arcane missile spell is, I might could take them out at, like, level six or seven. Oh, huh. I don't know. You got serious computer problems, Jolinar. What are you doing over there? Hello again, Peyton. Oh, I just want sticks. I just want level five. Just want level five. And then I want level six and level seven, level eight, level nine. But until such point, I just want those levels. That's it. So, Peyton, uh, since uh, you're also new to the stream, I'm curious. You said you liked my videos, so why did you start watching? I'm always curious how people started watching. Uh, Bad Beauty, or, uh, yeah, Bad Beauty, I forget. I'm trying to remember when I first saw your comments. Was it on, was it on WoW or Elder Scrolls? I feel like it was one of those, or I could be completely wrong. All right, so we want five by five. So one, two, three, four. Oh, that's right. I didn't build this one because it's going to be more expensive. Aha, thank you. The shame is, like, even though this takes more wood, I think it gives the same experience. One, two, three, four. Damn. Can I build any of these other ones? Yes, I can. I want to build whatever I can just to get our experience up as fast as humanly possible. But yeah, the auto pillars or whatever they do, I think that's a pretty neat system. Gotta say, I think that's a neat system. Oh, that's right, a throne, good point. Well, I don't want the throne yet. I want the throne in the back. How, well, one, two, three. Yeah, I want it back a little further. Because it's if I put it now, it's gonna be right in the middle of the room. Though I guess I could destroy it and rebuild it. I think it's free. I think. We'll put it down, and then if it turns out it's not free after you've made the first one, it's going to be your ass. We'll go with that. How about that? That sounds good to me. You best not claim my settlement. Stay away from my settlement. All right. I think sticks actually respawn fairly quick, but we're still going to go over here. I'm going to go to a new area around here. And I'm going to, uh, and somebody pointed this out, uh, and actually they weren't being rude. In fact, they were specifically trying to not be rude. But somebody pointed out early on, like in my second video, I think, how I was, like, it was kind of, it was getting boring because I was just building that one. I guess that's when I was trying to build that bridge. So it got boring just watching me try to collect enough to build a giant bridge. So I was like, you know, fair enough. I was like, but my second video series, or if you like skip ahead three videos, that's when I really started to explore more. 
So I'm trying to, I'm going to try to build like a basic house and then really start exploring the area, fighting enemies, taking over camps, see what that actually gets us, if anything, all that kind of stuff. But I definitely want to get our, our sweet little house set up. I do feel like if you can, once you can get supplies quicker, I feel like if you just consistently build and build and build, I feel like you're going to end up leveling a lot faster. Yeah, Elder Scrolls was... Oh, it was Elder Scrolls Online. Cool. MMO Let's Plays are, like, are interesting in that they tend to not... All, unless it's like a brand new MMO, they don't tend to be very popular at first, but they get fairly consistent viewership over like a long time. Like I still get comments on stuff like my uh, my I'm just checking to see what level these things are. These fairy sprites. Okay, level four. I can come murder these later. Um, but yeah, I, I still get consistently messages on like Terra, my Terra Let's Play. And that Terra Let's Play is like at least four years old, if not older. So are you all caught up bad on the Elder Scrolls? Because I think I just uploaded the last one on Tuesday. Um, Peyton, I plan on streaming either Saturday or Sunday, one of those days. I don't know the time frame. Probably if I stream on Saturday, it'll probably be around 6 o'clock or later. If I stream on Sunday, it could be anywhere starting from around like 3 to 4 o'clock until later. So, unfortunately, I don't have a, a set yet. I haven't decided just yet. But I should, I'll, if I don't stream Saturday, I, I should almost certainly stream Sunday. Stay away, you fairy. I remember those fairy things are actually pretty nasty. Let's, um, speaking of, let's go ahead and make a health potion or two. That'll give us some experience, too. I'm going to make them all. In our forge that's in our pants. Eh. We're going to wait. I want to, I kind of want to fight it. But one, it's getting dark, and two, I don't want to take the chance of losing all this stuff we've collected. So we're going to put a hold on that. Thanks for coming by, though, Peyton. I definitely plan on streaming more. Like I say, the goal is to stream about twice a week, at least for now. And then maybe picking it up as we go along. We'll see. Oh. There's a wolf. Magic missile. Magic missile. Stupid elk. I've, I have bested the lowly wild elk. So yeah, see that guy gave me the hide that we need to make actual leather armor. We might... I haven't decided on armor. Again, I feel like there's got to be a difference other than just armor class. Like otherwise, why would you not just make the wild armor? Pick all this up. Mostly want this for potions. Oh. I keep thinking if I press E again, it'll... Uh-oh. Take all. Some took all. Level four? We could probably take this little bastard out. Suck it. I like them apples. Bitch. Boom. Good timing because we just ran out of mana. Uh. Wait. Do you say, say, say it again? What was the question? Yeah. See, that's the thing. Also, hello, Mojoni. Damn it. You say that now. But I've already spent the whole one point to get this. I want to at least try the wand. I, I guess say I wanted to pick the axe, really. Because I think that axe is pretty badass. 
Like, I didn't even need magic with the axe. But, though, to be fair, part of that is because the AI is just really bad at... <laughs> Once you start circle stroffing, the game is like, I don't know what to do anymore. Don't be sad. Be glad. Be glad that you just joined. But, yeah, I mean, that's the thing. It's like, it's survival game with no elements of survival. So that's why I don't really think... And I think the reason people, myself included mistakenly are assuming that it's survival is because when you think survival, not only do you think food and water, you think first person's perspective, generally, um, gathering resources, like, you know, wood, metal, stone, a building, a settlement, house, etc. Uh, leveling up your building skills, you know, building a city with your friends, all that kind of stuff. Like, it's it's got all those elements it's just missing the having to eat having to drink having to deal with hot weather cold weather having stamina when you run things like that uh they do not call no i don't think it's they don't really call it survival because of the pvp element because they because they have specific pve servers uh, like i think even stuff like arc the official servers, I think, I think, and I could be wrong, but I think they, you know what's funny is I still, like, mentally, I avoid water at night, especially because I think, oh, if I get wet, I'll freeze to death. And then I'm like, wait, no, wrong game. I forgot that you can get tons of wood in the, in the lake. After the first two hours, you don't really care about food or water. Eh, ever. I would say that's true to an extent, sort of. But there's times where if you don't plan right, you run out of food and water. Especially in Ark, where like you, you use more food or you use more water if it's really hot. Like uh, in the caves, for example, like you go through, I think it's food, like really fast. I'm overburdened now. You go through food really quick. So you have to plan that out. You have to think, okay, well, I'm going to be in the caves for a while. I need plenty of uh, food. I'm going to make some more potions, I think. Oh, can I make one more, really? Actually, I'll increase my carrying capacity now. I forgot I had an extra point. And I'll start making my way back to the base. Because we're about to level again. Yeah, sorry. I'm I'm behind as well, Bad Beauty. I'm really bad about reading the chat. I'm it's one of those things I'm working on. I'm working on getting better at it. Nice. Level 5. Thank God. Cuz we get the most important thing in the entire game. At least I think so, especially as a crafter. Though I can't imagine not buying the gathering spell so the extract spell the way this works those of you who have might not have seen this uh basically the way spells work in this game period is you they're tied to your weapon like as far as i can tell you can't cast any spells while you're uh while you're not wielding a weapon damn it i want to get through here but i don't want to fight a ton of these things i just want to get through but you have to have a weapon of some kind and uh, you tie your spells to the weapon. Like I did, like I just drag and drop them. Uh, I heard you. Wow, you can like machine gun that shit. Apparently this is the Uzi of the magic world. But um, yeah, so you tie the magic spells to the staff like I did. So I have a left click spell and a right click spell. The left click spell is magic missiles. And the right click is extract. Oh, did they nerf foundations? Mm. Yeah, I I think somebody in the chat, I think maybe it was Tally, might have mentioned it. That uh, that building foundations gave a ton of experience.
Yeah, I cannot multitask very well, which you'd think after like however many years of doing Let's Plays, I'd be a lot better at. But one, two, oh man, this is, I hate, I hate the way this works. Like it's not what you point at. Like see how I'm pointing at that, but it's trying to put stuff to the side. I mean, I think it's doing that because it's, I can't build there, which is fine. But one, two, three, ah, oh, come on, three. Seriously? Yeah, the pointing is a, is definitely wonky. One. One, two. God bless. Two, three, four, five. Okay, God, that is a pain in the butt. Like the, I get the cursor just doesn't know what to point at. It's like, I'm all over the damn place. Honestly, if if anything, they shouldn't be nerfing experience gains. Or at the very least, they need to be giving you more knowledge points. Because, man, like, you really can't do much with what they give you. Which I, I get the idea is supposed to be you're supposed to be grouped up and multiple people split up. But split up like what you buy. All right. Boost movement speed and regenerate 60 health and mana. I almost want to think, get those instead. I mean, I'm assuming they're harder to make. The, the, shot, the fireball sounds like a shotgun. That's pretty funny. Wait, what do you do about a PvP? Uh, let's pick the mana. Let's just pick the mana. Because I'm guessing it's like way easier. And here, yes. Oh, wow. We have enough for a ton of them. I'll make 10 because I always need a bunch. I'll make 15. F it. More experience. Experience. Don't get what? Oh, wait, which ones? The Well, I didn't get it. You guys are way behind. We're, well, like 30, well, no, like 60 seconds behind. Yeah, I don't really go the PvP route almost ever. If I was with an organized group, I think it would be more fun. But since half the time I'm either not with the organized group or it's just like a couple of us. Like when we were playing Ark, it was like three of us. You're not really gonna do much with three people on a PvP server other than maybe like gank people randomly. So what's bad about the purple one? Most PvPers, like most PvP servers at the very least are, oh God, like, yeah. Like, uh, I'm sure, like, oh, shit, we got the spell now. Why aren't we picking up rocks like a damn homeless person? I just don't want to be ganked by random people who are just, like, running around with, like, far superior gear to me. Like, in Ark, I can only imagine. Like, you're out doing stuff to make your stone axes and people with AK-47s roll up. I don't think you can actually make AK-47s, but you can make guns. Yeah, I like the way the game looks. I gotta say the dark and light. I watched some videos on that. That game looks pretty good too. Like visually. It looks pretty darn good. Yeah, see that's the problem. Like, and I get that there's like that whole element with gearing up. And, like, the challenge of getting to the top. But I feel like once you get to the top, then it kind of gets boring. Like, if there's no one else to challenge you. Because I've heard that's what's happening on Albion online. It's like, I've heard it's basically now almost all the, the top zones are owned by the big PvP guilds. Like, the Zerg guilds. And you can't really do anything about it because there's just so many of them. Because I, I played Guild Wars 2 with, a, like, a top-end PvP guild. And it was definitely nice for a change to actually be with a group of people who are communicating 
and actually, you know, working together instead of just randomly doing crap. Like, that was super cool. But I just, like, I played too many other games. Like, I feel like if you're gonna do PvP stuff, uh, especially on a game like Ark, I feel like you need to be, like, dedicated to that game and to that guild. Which is all, like, totally fine. But I'm not that person. Like, I'm not gonna dedicate that much time to it. Uh, top level, wait, there's level 60s in this game already? Is that what you mean? Or are you saying level 60s in something else? I'm basically just going to mostly harvest wood to build up my house. And then we'll uh, go run around and kill stuff. I want to try to take that camp. I'm hoping by the time I build the house to completion, I'll be at around level 7. And I want to try to take that camp. I'm going to pick up some other stuff while we wait for this. Wait, how do they... Wait, they're leeching off you how? Like, with gear? Or do you share experience, Mojani? The last part of your name sounds like my name, so saying Mojani makes me, makes me want to turn around. Oh, God damn it, cat. So she, like, went to sleep, and now she's back to sleeping in her bed. She's not sleeping in the box after we moved it. What a butthole. Oh, you share XP. So how far away can you share XP? Like, is it... Like, do you have to at least be within a certain range of each other? Yeah, my name is Johnny. So, like, when I say, oh, Johnny, I'm like, what? Who called my name? All right, not enough mana. That's fine. But, yeah, in games like this, like, I don't mind the fighting. Like, you know, killing enemies, like, PvE shit. But, like, I honestly just like the building and the harvesting. I don't know if I was some kind of weird gatherer in a past life. Tapping into my caveman DNA or some shit. But, like, there's something about gathering resources. And even just that, the gathering resources, I find, uh, for some reason, enjoyable. Maybe relaxing is the word I'm looking for. But I, I love it. It's sickening, but I love it. And I hate myself for it. Um, let's start building the walls. I might not. Oh, God damn it! I hate this point system. I cannot even tell you. Level six. All right, let's destroy this wall. We might have got enough back to make another wall. Nope. All right. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead. Let's go with, um, I'm going to do a little more health. Since we are going to do more fighting, I want to start getting my health up. Really? So you can only, like, share XP with certain, we certain weapons? That's weird. Yeah, see, see, Mo Johnny, that's exactly what I think... If I wasn't doing YouTube stuff, and if I, w if I wasn't, like, so against dedicating that so much time to a single game, I think that's the kind of stuff I would absolutely have loved, like, ten years ago. Where it's like, I'm, I'm, a, like, I like to build. I'm not creative with my buildings, obviously, because I'm building yet another square building. But I like to build. I like to gather resources. I like to do a little PvE, but, the, and, you know, maybe PvP once in a while. But for the most part, that's the parts of the game I like. That's where it's cool to have a guild where it's like, okay, you have your crafters, you have the people who love to craft, love to gather, you can have them doing their thing. And the PvPers can go and, like, fend off attackers, they can go kill enemy tribes for loot or blueprints. You've got the PvEers who can go kill creatures for uh, resources like leather or rare gems or loot or whatever. See, that kind of stuff I think is awesome. Like, that's why I like the idea of games like this that support different playstyles and encourage people to to group up who had different playstyles. So yeah, uh, so Majani, what do you mean by fixed rating? What do you mean? Uh, 
uh, build more walls. Mr. Gorbachev? No, Mr. Gorbachev, you misheard me. Mis heard me. I meant to build even more walls. Thousands upon thousands, rows of walls. Sorry if I'm missing text, by the way. Text is actually moving fairly quick, at least for my chat. Uh, so if I miss something, like, and if there's something in particular, like, you really wanted me to see, just do, like, at Vertigo Tea Party, and, like, it makes it easier for me to see. Obviously, don't do that constantly, because then I'll never see anything else. Or I won't even see that. But, again, I'm, I'm trying to learn. I do apologize. I'm working on it. Oh, you can break a wood wall in five seconds. Stone only takes a little bit longer. Wow. Yeah, that would seem pointless. You spend all that time gathering resources and building, and then somebody, like one person can walk by and is like, hey, nice place you got. Be a shame if something happened. Oh, never mind. I've already destroyed it. How did... So, Mojani, did you play uh, Ark? And if so, did you PvP? And if so, how did they fix rate? Because I felt like with with Ark, didn't you have to do some kind of thing where you and the defending parties had to agree on a certain time so that you couldn't just raid their base at 4 in the morning? Yeah, that would be good for that. Or if, like, you, like uh, somebody else was leaving the chat and wanted to know, like, uh, like how long... Or if I was going to stream tomorrow. Like, that would be another perfect example. Ah, uh, yeah. See, that's the... Here's the other problem that I don't like with games like this and PvP. Is that, especially early on, in PvP, people are going to find exploits. To try to, like, either kill your guild, or steal from you, or to break your bases, and all that shit. So, you've got to deal with people trying to find exploits to do all this crap to destroy your stuff. So you can have all your stuff destroyed by a bug or an exploit or something like that. And that's always uh, kind of a pisser. Uh, I'm actually not even going to build a door yet. Did I build a roof? No. I want a roof. Damn it. All right. So how are we doing on knowledge points? We have six. It takes three more for a roof. What else can we do? So we can't build a new weapon until what? 10? Yeah, we can't build an upgraded weapon until 10. Brooms at 10. See, that's the thing. I'm thinking about if I want to go straight for cloth or just wait for leather. I'm thinking I'm going to wait for leather. Because 10 is not too far away. And I still don't really know. Also, maybe Mojoni, Mojoni knows. Uh, so is there, like, what's the difference between the leathers? Other than the actual armor classes, obviously. What's the difference between, like, a cloth cap versus a skull cap versus a scarecrow? Is it just purely armor and that's it? Or are there, like, other benefits or negatives? You can make C4 in that game. That's insane. Yeah, suck it. Can wolf. I want a chest too. Let me see what I need for the chest, because the chest is pretty damn important. It's level five, so we can we get it uh four points. And it's really expensive, but I really need a chest. Uh, a respawn stone wouldn't be a bad idea either. I also, yes, I do forget pronunciations. Yeah, I think uh, the point of PvE in this game is to do dungeons. I think My understanding is that there's dungeons that you can fight through, which I'm guessing there's chests and stuff like that. Uh, all right. Oh, wait, it's under. Because there's two different build menus, so I always get myself confused. Uh, the respawn stone still takes that. Uh, we Oh, shit. We can't build... The, uh, I forget. You can't build a chest until you have a way to smelt the damn iron. Which takes the forge, which takes two points. Well, we might as well. 
<sighs> we might as well. Let's go ahead and build that. I still love having this lava e forge in the uh, wooden house. That's awesome. All right, let's get some iron. Yeah, I would think that I would think they'd have some kind of balancing act, right? Like so cloth shirts, maybe you're fast you run faster with those, or you cast faster, or you can regenerate mana, or something like that. Or maybe they can hold more magical properties. While plate gives you more armor, but can only have two magical properties or something like that. <clears throat> that happens a lot with rocks. Okay, come on. We done? Nope, we still not. <laughs> okay, well, we're just gonna leave that rock alone because it's cursed. Like every uh oh, I hope we're not la or no. Are we lagging or something? Nope. We're able to get wood. LOL. Yeah, I would hope stuff like dragons are gonna be really tough. Yeah, they all say, but I thought they all said three. Let me double check. I didn't actually look that in depth. So hat says three magical properties. That one's three, three, four. So actually the iron gives you four magical properties and more armor. I mean, you have to be higher level to forge it. But like that's one of those things like I feel like kind of sucks because if you join a guild and you're level one, you can just have somebody give you a bunch of iron armor, which I actually consider that negative. I know some people don't, but... That's one thing I do not like about survival games. If you're going to play with friends, if they already have an established guild, I don't like joining and then being like, oh, hey, level one, here's all the top end armor or here's like a whole bunch of high end weapons and stuff. It's like it, it kind of kills part of it for me because part of it for me is building up to that point. Uh, I, oh, maybe it does. Now making it. Oh, yeah, see, there it is. Well, it says required level 18. I don't know if that means required level. I know you have to be at least level 18 to unlock the ability to make it. I don't know if it also means you have to be level 18 to wear it. Ah, okay, so yeah, Mojani confirmed that uh, you can be given the high level stuff, but you can't wear it until you're higher level. That's... An interesting way of doing it. All right, I think these rocks are just bugged out. Because I saw this in beta, but usually if I tapped it once and then tapped it again, it would work. All right, let's try some other rocks. These are apparently the Cursed Isles. Ah, you found cur uh, leather armor that required level 15. That's weird that it required level 15. Oh my god, is everything on the ground bugged? Other than the trees? Well, we're having no luck so far. I mean, yeah, my rocks are broken. That's what the doctor said. He said, son, your rocks are broken. Come on. Oh. Well. This is kind of a pisser. Pick up the stick. Yeah, like, I, yeah, I've never run into a point where it's like, you have too much wood. <laughs> you have taken too much Viagra. You have too much wood currently. Well, shit. Uh, maybe they broke that recently. Because like I say, I had that problem before, but to a much lesser extent. If I tapped it once and then tapped it again. Which there was a hundred jokes to make there, but I'm going to leave it alone. Uh, it would work. How are we on space all right i'm gonna go i'm gonna go drop stuff off oh no wait no i'm not because i can't get any goddamn ore i'm gonna take my frustration out on this elk screw you elk now exploits i don't really care about 
Because that kills the fun for me. If I have to exploit, like, generally speaking, that's not to say that uh, I haven't done some, yeah, some shady stuff in the past. But, um, but yeah, exploits, eh, not really that interested. Have you run into this problem here specifically, Mojani? Like where you can't like harvest iron ore or rocks? Cause it, I, I don't even think I can get rocks. Oh, I can get rocks. I can get stones, but I can't get any iron. And that's not a skill or anything. Like you don't have to get a skill to get iron as far as I know. Maybe I've been getting them. I actually did end up getting one ore. Did I just get it from this rock when I wasn't looking? Let's finish tapping out this rock. Oh, well, it's not, I guess, because we're... I did get one, so I had to get them from rocks for some reason. Oh, you said he ran into it too, just not as much. Huh. Um, We need to spend this wood. I got all this wood. I don't know what to do with it. Sounds like a story of my life. Uh, ooh, let's make the walls bigger. We'll do that. There we go. We'll have like a one level house that's like really tall. To be fair, I think I made some pretty creative houses in uh, Minecraft. And I liked my, I liked our base in Ark. I designed most of our uh, most of the actual design of uh, our house in Ark. And I thought it was pretty neat, at least. You don't get iron from small rocks, as far as I know. You might get a little. Well, Mojani, here's the thing. like, And I don't know if I was just getting lucky when I played before, during the beta. But like these rocks, like this rock that's like darker... I actually got a decent amount of ore from those. Now, I don't know if I was just getting, like, it might not matter. No! Not enough mana. Oh my god. A rabbit lived. Nope. There we go. Own that rabbit. But, uh, yeah, like, I was finding that I was getting more ore from the dark rocks. Now, I, again, I don't know if that was just luck. Or something else. But that's the way it was working during the open beta. Be beta, not beta. Jesus, what's a beta? Well then, Mojani, any ore that you find going forward from small black rocks, 100% you must credit to me. You must say my name every time you get an ore from a small black rock. Yeah, I'm still getting some from the stone, so I'm just going to get it from this. The only thing that sucks is I'm going to have to end up destroying a lot of stone. Well, maybe not. If I can get enough ore to make the box. We have three now. Uh-oh. Found another bug. Which is funny, because I actually do uh, quality assurance in real life. I should be reporting these bugs. But no thanks. I. It's already not a ton of fun in real life. Oh, that's right. It takes two for every one. Damn it. Janet. There's another elk. I do want to start gathering leather, because I'm going to skip the, uh, the cloth. I don't know why I just leveled up, but I'll take it. Sorry, just replying to somebody in uh, general chat. Sorry, Elky. Yeah, so at least at least I can still get the iron from the big rocks. That's good. I'm not like completely screwed. Cause that would be uh, that would be kind of a game killer. There's the second ore. I love our misshapen house. Honestly, I did kind of want to make a more interesting house this go around, but. Again, I've kind of spent a lot of time already building in the last video, so I wanted to spend a little more time like going around and fighting enemies and doing more offensive stuff. Um, I think let's go with more health. More health is always good, especially since we don't have any armor yet. Do we have enough? 